Okay. Oh, we'll only tonight. Yo, what is up, guys? Air just cause here once again with Law on the High Side Racing League. And tonight we are here for Talladega. It's going to be a good one here today. I'm Air just cause once again by myself. Smoking is not here tonight, sadly. So uh, hopefully tonight we're going to have a good race and some uh, interesting uh, passing today. Um, you know, that's what we hope. Oh, hold on, guys. Oh, hold on. I'm going to go to Twitch on my tablet real quick. 0417. There we go. There we go. And there we go. Okay, I can get Twitch on my tablet. What's up, Rock? What's up, Rock? Yes, here we go. Should have some good night of racing. This is going to get interesting, so... Oh, well, here we go. 29 laps. Stage one. Here we go. Green flag here from Talladega. Here we go. And then here we go. Coming into turn number one. Everybody there. Are they going to have the Weeble Wobbles today? Here we go. Not very many so far. Just a little tiny bit of Weeble Wobbles. Here we go. Out of turn number two. Down the back straight away we go. 24 is going to get out of the line. Two and the one are going to go to the bottom. Outside lane trying to get going here already. Down the back into turns three and four. We got two solid lines. Three wide up at the front. Here we go. Oh, 17 looking three, but no, is going to get back in line on that 19. Here comes that six on the outside. Who's going to lead lap number one? Is it going to be the two? Will it be the one? Oh, two's going to move out of line. Here comes the one, and it looks like it's going to be a drag race, and the one is going to lead lap number one. Well, yeah, well. I think um, right now it's going to get interesting um, at the end of this race. I don't know about the start of this race already. Yeah, you know, I'm thinking. Um, I'm thinking tonight could be a could be a little calm stage one right here. It already looks like it's going to be a lot of cars already getting single file. Some cars dropping to the rear already off the bat. Slight Savage is in the lead, followed by the 21. Um, that is uh, Jack Baseball currently up in P2. And then uh, looks like the 8 going to get out of line. So that's going to bring the 6 of B13 up the 3rd. And that that, uh, that row right there, that, that whole pack behind this 21, is about to be a huge run here out of turn 2. Because look at the gap between the 6 and the 21. They are currently going to probably get a huge run here. Okay, this is interesting because they're really not gaining. Well, here we go. They might start gaining now. It looks like the 21 and the 1 are going to go side by side here in turns 3 and 4. Another battle for the lead. 3 wide for the lead. The 9's going to split through the middle. And the 9 goes to the lead. What a move! Wow, the 9 with a huge run and will get it. And he's going to drop to the rear. He just wanted to, he just wanted to, um, he just wanted to lead one lap, I guess. <laughs> I just wanted to lead one lap. The 1's going to try and let the 9 in, but the 9 doesn't want that. 8's going to make it 3 wide right here. There we go. A lot of cars already. 21's got a huge lead. This is already a very weird start to Talladega. Um, I did not expect this. Let me tell you. I did not expect this. This is a little bit of a weird, weird, weird start at Talladega. Oh. Uh, already, is there single file? Couple cars trying to line up on that outside. This, this possibly could not be good for some people, but, you know. They're not giving me very much to talk about, but 21's going to go and drop to the rear. 6 and uh, 17 are going to take those spots away, and the 6 is going to go to the lead, so the Roush boys. 1, 2, 8 with a big run, 19 with a big run. 
and the 8 goes to the lead. And the 19 goes to second. What is going on right now? There is there Matrix is about to go to the lead. And Okay, RTSB Matrix is your leader. Oh, you don't hear that often. You don't hear that often. Yeah, and look at the 19 and the 8. The 19 and 8 are gone. <laughs> the 19 and the 8 just checked out from the rest of the field. What in the world is going on right now? I don't know what's going on. This is insanity. Well, already the most interesting start to a Talladega race. Most interesting start to the race so far. Uh, yeah, the eight, yeah, the eight and the nineteen are gone right now. They're out of here. They're you know, they're basically, they're basically gone. This pack can still catch them because it is still a two-car pack versus like the rest of the field. So definitely they're gonna get probably trained here. But the nineteen has probably led the most laps right now that he has in his whole career. So you know, congratulations to the nineteen. Here goes big run from the six. Holefield's gonna basically go with them, and the six is gonna power to the lead. And goodbye to the 19 and eight. <laughs> yes, yeah, so they're gonna go to the top here. Hold on, we got high side train. We got a high side train. Oh, 14's gonna drop low. Here we go, and then they're all gonna go back to the bottom. And uh, already a very interesting start to this race. I don't know how to sum it up right now, but it is uh, it is definitely interesting, I guess. I mean, I don't know how to call this already. I mean, it's, we've already seen single file. We've seen two car. We've seen two cars pull out to a huge lead. We've, you know, it is interesting. Huh. How everyone's racing right now. I don't know. There might be some strategy going on. There might be some fuel saving. You know, you never know. But it's it's interesting. It's it's very interesting how this is going right now. So here we go. Yeah, let's see what happens. This is a. Uh, this is basically where the race is going to get a little bit boring here, folks. Single file. You know, we're hearing a lot of guys talking about fuel already. You know, that that's going to be the big big thing today is going to be that fuel. That, you know, the fuel is going to be interesting. We definitely know some of these stages could be a save opportunity. But uh, also tires. Tires are going to be an interesting thing with the tire management. Two tires, four tires, no tires. You know, everybody's going to bump their pressures up to 60. So, you know, it's definitely going to get interesting in this race. So let's just see what happens, you know, from here. Because right now it is just a single file line. There could be some, uh, could be some interesting, uh, interesting parts of this race. As they are still single file, they're, they are still single file, folks. They're, they're like, they're, they're at the line at the DMV, single file and orderly right now. Because right now, no, no chaos is opened up. It ain't, you know, this is what, this is the line that looks like you go up to the DMV, get your driver's license and all that, and get your ID, you know, this is, this is your line at the DMV. We haven't seen where Black Friday comes around and everybody's everywhere. So, you know, we're kind of waiting for that Black Friday to kind of come in. And right now, we're just kind of looking at the DMV right now. I'm sorry, by, by the way, I'm all by myself tonight. My buddy's smoking, just did not decide to join me tonight, I guess. Um, you know, sad faces for me, sad face, sad face, but... um. You know, of course, we're going to try our best here tonight for a very interesting, uh, should be a very interesting race here. So we got um, a couple cars kind of just barely hanging on to the pack. The one's checking up here to get those cars back, but it's like the 24, I think it's the 88, the 9, the 4. They're basically kind of 
trying to hang on to this pack. I'm going to guess that uh, right now they're trying to get up to the pack right now. Yeah, there's the nine. Yeah, there's the nine who, um, yeah, the f we're hearing the four just lost the pack. So, and then the 18 has also lost the pack as well. So, a couple cars have already lost the pack early on. And it is still currently a single file train. Thomas the Tank Engine has came early. And uh, right now, right now, it's the 6 and the 17 who are up front right now. Well, I hope everybody's having a nice night. Um, having a nice day as well. Uh, you know, it's about to be the end of uh, November. We're about to head into December. So, you know. Hopefully everybody's excited for that. Excited for the holidays. Uh, right now it looks like uh, it's a very interesting, very complex race, I guess you can kind of say. So right now I'm just looking at the 17, I'm looking at the 6, looking at the 2, looking at the 22. I mean, it is, or not 22, 12. I mean, it's currently, it's just currently single file. We got a couple cars pitting. Two's pin, six pin, seventeen. We're gonna have a handful of cars. Fourteen, nineteen. We're gonna have a huge pack here coming down pit road. Another big part of this race will be, yeah, it will be the um, the staying out and the strategies of uh, coming in. Another part is entry on pit road. We saw it messed up um, a couple of times. Oh, the twenty ones around. Eighty eight, twenty four, three. That's a caution. That should be a caution, and I think it is a caution. Well, um, well, um, well, everyone crashes, everyone wrecks, caution is out, and, uh, yeah, the big one has just struck at Talladega early. Well, um, already it's gonna put a little wedge in those uh, in the in the thing. So yeah, you got cars on pit road. Those are actually gonna benefit the cars that are on pit road. Actually, yeah. So here we go. Two and six on the front row. Green flag. Here we go. All right, a pretty good start. Two and 17. All right, a couple cars falling back in line right here. All right, here we go. Through turns one and two, those weeble wobbles could be a huge factor right now. So here we go, down the back straightaway. Yeah, two, 17, 14. Currently your top three as we head down the back into turns three and four here in a little bit. 19 is going to try and get out of line. Here we go. Yeah, two and 17 working really well together. 14 is trying to get a good draft here up to the 17 with help from the 12. One is their four wide almost. And already a very interesting start to this race. Let me tell you, a very interesting start to this race. Yeah, all right. Very interesting already. Right. Very interesting uh, start to this one. I mean, still stage one. I mean, it, it, everybody's currently single file right now. It's definitely a single file race. It has been a single file race since the start. It, you know, I don't know how this rest of the stage is going to go. I don't know if we're going to get some moves to the high side. I don't know what we're going to have. But, you know, these guys are going to have to build some uh some runs up here they're gonna have to build some momentum that's gonna be the big thing so let's just see what happens it's gonna be a big thing it's gonna be a big thing uh today to see what happens here you look at the look at uh right now the single file line oh look everybody's trying to make sure they stay in line right here it's gonna be a big thing
Oh, nine. Nine's going to make a run. Nine, but no help. No help. Zero help. We're hearing the ones radio. He's just trying to survive for some laps. <laughs> That's what we're hearing. Like I said, let's just see what happens. It's definitely going to be a very interesting race for sure. Here we go. I don't know what to talk about, boys. It's single file, folks. Um, let's go through the field. Let's go through the field from your leader to second place. You know, let's go through the field. Um, let's go up to your leader, who is currently the two car. Mr. Ding, one of the title favorites this season, has a lot of wins. You know, is doing really well so far this season. You know, cannot wait to see how he's going to perform. The 17 of Joe Boo. Couple wins this season, you know. Uh, he's had multiple chances for wins, and you know he's kind of messed them up late in the race. Whether it's his fault or somebody else's fault, you know this 17. He's looking to see if he can get a win, another win this season. The 14 of Italian Stallion is going to get shuffled out of line a little bit. Actually, a couple cars are going to go to the back here. Italian, you know, one of those guys, you know, he's got a couple wins this season. You know, he's doing a great job right now. We're going to see what that 14 can do uh, here tonight. Of course, he had a hunter boy hasn't won yet this season but you know still very solid he's been doing well in a couple of races uh he did really good at atlanta not too long ago uh he's looking to see if he can uh perform here today get another good finish keep that momentum uh there's the nine of mr trick one of the other title favorites um as he's trying to make his way up there as he's gonna pass here he's gonna get hung out the dry on the top right now um, he's looking to see if he can get another win this season. He's been solidly consistent. Um, he's been doing a great job, leading a lot of laps, winning a couple stages, got a couple wins this season. He's looking to see if he can get another one. The four Caleb, his best finish last season came here. It's second, one of his best finishes. Um, you know, just came up short in this race one season ago. He's hoping today that. He can capture that magic once again and actually win the race this time. Uh, we're going to hope that four car uh, can do well today. Ian, another guy, you know, he's been solidly improving through the season. Even though he's he's not, he's still, he's gotten a little bit faster. He's started to compete with a couple of people now. Um, you know, he's been doing well. And one of his bread and butters, oh, we got a bag. Whoa, what is the two doing? Uh, the two, the the two car is, um, um, can I just say the two car was twerking? He was twerking. <laughs> uh, the, um, he, he was, he was, he was twerking side to side. The two car was twerking side to side. I don't know. I don't know if I, I don't even know. I've ever seen a rear of the, rear, I can't even speak. <laughs> What's up, Sniper? Oh, my God. Dude, I, I don't even think I've ever seen a, a rear end of a race car move like that ever in my life. <laughs> that was a huge lag. <laughs> I can't even speak. Oh, wow. Okay, well, the two uh, got a lag warning. I don't know. Technically, is this count of him dropping to the back? I don't, I don't know. God, that was a huge huge lag from the two but yeah the nine's out of the pack now that's not going to help him uh, yeah we got a little little um little you know checkup right there a little bitty checkup let's see yeah sniper hyper said d-e-t a-yo <laughs> sniper said a-yo <laughs> what's up what's up uh sniper Sniper Hyper. Um, what happened in UPSF1 today? I saw you spin out there at the, uh, um, you know, after the first pit cycle or, the, you know, the only pit cycle of the day. So, 12 is going to get shuffled out of line here. 24 is going to go to the lead. 12 is going to get back in line, though, in second. A little swap between the 12 and the 24 working together. You know, good push from the 6 to the 12. 12 is going to get pushed to the 24. 
Oh, yeah, at 18. Oh, here comes the three, a killer. Another guy who's been doing good on the plate races recently. Um, he's doing a great job, you know, doing a, uh, doing his best here on these plate races. Uh, he's also been at least a little bit better on other racetracks this season. We've seen him run pretty decently uh, as of late as well. So, you know, pretty, pretty proud of that three car. He's got four to go. Sniper says the curbs suck. <laughs> Uh, I know the curves are terrible. The curves are terrible in F1 2021, so I don't blame you, especially in Netherlands where every curb is like a sausage curb. But um, but here we go. We're going to be coming to three to go this time in stage one. 24 up front. The 12 is in second, and then the six is in third right now. <laughs> I still got fourth, I believe. Yeah, and I won the race. Well, here we go. Out of turn four. The question is, who's going to make the first move for a stage win? It's, uh, the one is... Uh, I don't know what the one's doing. Uh, who's going to make that move on the 24 right here for the stage... Yeah, for the stage, uh, stage win. Three to go. Oh, the 12. The 12 has an opportunity for a huge run right here. Same for the six. They have opportunities for huge runs right here. Yeah, 12 with a run, but he's going to back off. He doesn't want to take it. This, yeah, well, the six right now. Yeah, the six is just, yeah. Well, there's the uh, six. He's backing off with the three. Oh, the one gets underneath the three, though. That's going to shuffle the three out of line. Three wide back here between the 17, the 88, and the 19. Oh. Well, uh, I don't know what's going on. Oh, the three's trying to get back in line. But, hey, he's got no gap to put his car back in. Two to go. We're going to have one to go at the line. Who's going to make that move? Right now, oh, six is making that move. 24 blocks. Oh, the six. Oh, huge run for the 17 to the rear bumper to the six. Six into the one. Oh, 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 oh. Don't, don't do anything stupid. Don't do anything stupid. Oh, he did something stupid. Oh, he saved it. He fixed his stupidness. Here we go. Come to one to go. <laughs> stage one, by the way. This might sound like it's the end of the race, but it's not. It's only stage one. <laughs> Who's going to make that move? 18's good. That high side's got some people. That, that high side's got a couple people in it. It's got about five cars, roughly. If it gets any more, 14. I don't know where he's going. He's playing uh, He's playing that yellow line game here down the back. I don't think anybody's making a move. I think 24's got it. Unless Oh, well, 18 shuffles to 12. Oh, oh, and the 12 puts the one on the apron. Oh, the one wrecks. Big crash. And that's going to be a caution. And the stage ends. The 24 will win stage number one as the big one happened. Yeah, I mean, that one, if anybody has an issue, I think the 12 did. Uh, take uh, ownership of that crash right there. Um, oh, the nine has blown an engine. That's what happened. Would you like to join me in the booth? I'm lonely. Okay. Don't, at least don't. Okay, we might have the nine in the booth. Yeah, you do. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um. I yeah, let's see if it'll actually get to you here. Um. Is invite. It won't let me invite you to the game. But we're on, we're heading to restart here. Here we go. Green flag. Twenty-seven laps here. Stage two. Yeah, Andy, you're gonna have to wait for an invite about um. Uh, when a caution comes out or pit stops it won't let me invite you to the game but um here we go uh i hope that was on the stream uh yo 18 up front 
Ian, you know, the underdog here is, oh, we got a lot of cars shuffling out of line. We got all the three into the one. The one's in the wall a little bit. He's going to keep it off the wall. And the 18's got a huge lead on the 12, the 21, and the rest of the field. Somebody's going to have to kind of explain to me um, what in the world is going on right now because uh, the 18 is Ian. Of course, we talk about Ian, you know, a lot when he's in the back, you know. He's been he's actually kind of improved this season. I'm seeing him start running with people that he normally doesn't run with on normal weeks. So, you know, he's improving slightly, but he, he's been finding his bread and butter, which has been these plate tracks, these uh, Daytona and Talladega. You know, he's been doing a great job. He's been running decent at Michigan. He's ran decent at Auto Club. You know, he's ran a lot of pretty good races on these draft racetracks. You know, he's a guy that you might want to watch out for winning a Daytona or a Talladega race in the near future. If he starts improving a little bit on those short tracks and uh, mile and a half, I think he can be a real contender as what in the world is going on. I'm seeing the 88 do the cha-cha slide on the bottom lane. I'm seeing the 24 is going to go high. Yeah, we're hearing we're hearing a lot of guys are going to drop to the back because they don't know what's going up on up here in the front. Yeah, I'm seeing I'm seeing a couple people do that cha cha slide up there. You know, they're out there going left and right. Here comes the one. The one's below the apron. I don't know what he's doing. We're already I. What is with the uh, what is with the questionable moves right now? What's with those questionable moves? What are with those questionable moves, dude? <laughs> Give me question marks right now. I don't, I don't understand it, but right now it's it's looking pretty good up at the front. As, oh my god, this dude just liked about every tweet that I've had done in the last month. <laughs> I just looked at my Twitter. <laughs> Some guy just liked my like last 30 posts <laughs> on Twitter. I am I am speechless right now. But uh But yeah, right now it looks like uh this race it's been very questionable right now. We've had a couple of we had two big ones. We've had, you know, we've had a we've had two big ones. We've had a couple of a uh, couple of questionable moves. We've had a couple questionable calls. We've had a couple questionable you know, everything. Everything's been questionable. This is the questionable Talladega race. It's like a pop quiz. Got questions on questions on questions right now as the 9 has left the party. Oh, um, I don't know. I don't know right now. It's, I'm going to be by myself for the rest of the stream, probably. Uh, I'm so lonely up in the booth right now. I'm so lonely. I'm so lonely. Okay, well. <laughs> I am Mr. Lonely. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's the. It looks like the uh, 21 is gonna head to the back. We got a lot of guys shuffling. Do I have to pull it out? Do I have to pull out the Thomas the Tank Engine music? Do I have to? Well, then somebody make a move. Then somebody make a move. Somebody, somebody better make it side by side. Well, uh, we're hearing a shield strategy, so I'm going to grab a pillow real quick, then. Hold on. Oh, there's a pillow. Nice pillow. Nice soft pillow. Um, so as of right now, until probably, until probably the stage end, you're going to put your head on this pillow for probably about, maybe about 20 more laps. Uh, waiting to see what happens. Unless we wreck again on pit road, uh, pit entry, so... So, but right now, 18, 12, 4, top 3. 
Right now, here comes the one. One's going to go to the outside. He's making a move. He's going to get two spots out of it. Good move by the one. Right there, Slight Savage. He's going to make a move here on the 18. Uh, does he got enough of a run? Yes, he does. He's got enough of a run to go side by side here through the trial. Well, we got two packs basically right here. The one's going to make contact with the 18. And right now, you got two cars. It looks like the 12 might help the one right here. 18 up front, though. Here comes the four, and the one's going to tuck back in. That means it's going to lead the 12 out to dry. And the 12 is going to fall to the rear of that pack. Oh, well. Let's see what happens. Because right now, it is, uh, it is a single file Thomas the Tank Engine. Dun, 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. You know, nice Thomas the Tank Engine vibe going on. You know, right now it is very, very, very training. They they are just straight up training right now. It is not. Oh, one's gonna go outside again. At least he's making some moves. At least he's trying to make this battle for the lead interesting. But nobody's going with him. Nobody. Yeah, nobody's going with him. 18's going to continue to get that inside the work. Oh, he's going to hit the apron into the one. Down the back. Here comes the inside line. The one's got the edge here. The one's got the edge. But the 18's got the edge now. 88's going to come help the one. Let's see. More people on the bottom. As long as the 18 doesn't make a mistake, I think the one... Yeah, so the eight, 88 and the one are going to go back in line here. Second and third. It's the 18, all oh, the one making another run right here. This is currently a career day for Ian. This is probably the most laps I've ever seen him probably lead in the race. This is probably the most time I've seen him up front in the lead in a race. This is a career day so far right now for this 18. Look at how broken the bottom is. How the 18 still hanging on with no help right now. That's how that's how broken the bottom of the racetrack is right now here at Talladega. Look at him hold on right now. He's barely got any help. The one. Oh, the one is not clear. He's not clear. Oh, now he's clear. Well, I, I would clear myself too. <laughs> he basically just cleared himself right there. Well, as right now, as we are currently sitting here watching... Uh, somebody's mad because I just heard a lot of uh, a lot of f bombs in that uh in that uh Discord call right now. I don't know who it was that just dropped them, but um, so we're hearing a lot of pit pit strategy going on. We're hearing a lot of people announcing their fuel. There's some strategy going on. Okay, um, can I get a lap count here when y'all hit the line? Okay, thank you. If I'm not going to be able to play Thomas the Tank Engine, then I'll I'll sit here and ask for lap counts. Okay, 16 laps left here in stage two. I don't know what to tell y'all right now. Right now, it is just a strategy race, and then uh, yeah, it's just a strategy race right now. I don't know what else to tell y'all. 24 with a huge run. 18's going to be pitting, it looks like. It's like the 18 is pitting. I think the 1 and the 18 are going to let the 24 and the 88 might be... No, the 1's battling. The 18, I think, is going to come down pit road here due to the fact that he was the leader. And he did not save some fuel. Yeah, he cannot save fuel. So 18's going to head down pit road. Oh, I think he slowed it down. I think he slowed it down. So pit stops are starting. Who's going to be the next round of stops? The field is spread out. I mean, I mean the field's spread out enough where I don't think a caution can happen. But it uh, looks like we got one more. Yeah, we got we got one more car. Yeah, we got one car signaling to go in. I think it's the one or the four. 
I'm gonna think it's the one. I think it's the one because the four is way too high. Here we go. The one's gonna come down pit road right here. One lap after the 18. And the one is in. So next cars that should be probably coming down is either the this pack or the pack behind them. That is the big question. Let's see who's going to signal. Oh, we're hearing 24 is going to come down. Here we go. Yeah, that whole the whole front pack is pitting. A couple cars in that rear pack are going to be pitting. Actually, that whole rear pack is going to be pitting. Actually. So the whole rear pack is going to be coming in as well. That doesn't suit well for the rear pack due to how far behind they are. But here we go. Oh, the three's breaking early. We got a couple cars. Oh, the 12 hits the 24. Wow, that whole that rear pack might have caught up with that pit entry. With that pit entry, that whole rear pack possibly just caught back up to the field. Well, they're all pitting. Yeah, they're all in. So this is going to make everything interesting. There's Italian as we go through everyone. There's the 18 and there's the 1. It looks like the 18 and the 1 took two different uh, pit stops. So, you know, let's let's see what happens. I mean, there's going to be a lot of uh, interesting things. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Nice clean exit off of uh, Pit Road. So good job by these guys right here. Yeah, like I said, it's going to be interesting. I don't know what, what we're going to be thinking right here. It's going to definitely be a very lopsided style of uh, of strategy. So 12 is going to go up front. Oh, here comes the one. One with a huge run. Three wide. Three wide. Triple decker right here. The one with a huge run. Oh, 24 trying to get in line. Almost, almost wrecked himself. 88's going to get in line in front of the three. And right now we are going back to the train. Wait, what are we doing? What? Oh, we're going high, we're going low, we're going high, we're going low. We're going what, to the left. Take it back now, y'all. Come on, yeah, look at the two. He's taking it back. See, he's doing the cha-cha slide. Went right, take it back now. What not this time? <laughs> So, well. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I don't know how this is going to go. Right, do y'all need to pit one more time? Who needs to pit one more time? Okay, nobody? Okay, okay so we're, we're, we're hearing that, um that there is going to be uh, no more pit stops. I think only a couple cars do need the pit though. I think the one and the 18 are the big targets of the pit stops. They're gonna need to make one more three with a huge run. Here comes the three with the huge run. Oh, and the three's gonna go to second. Yes, he will. P2 for the three. Here comes Killer for the lead. He's like, I don't want second. I want the lead. Oh, yeah, the three's fighting. That three's fighting. He's like, I want to lead. Oh, and I don't know what. I don't know where the four is going. Yeah, but you turned right underneath, or not right, the left underneath the apron. <laughs> he had all four tires underneath there. <laughs> That's the. Okay, uh, he was nowhere even near you <laughs> on my screen. I don't know. The four thought the apron was a raceable lane. The the four the four car thought this was 1993, where you can actually use that line. <laughs> so.
So, is the four up front, three in second. Oh, the three. Oh, are we about to have a killer leading a Talladega race? We're going to have killer leading a Talladega race. Oh, my God. This is the weirdest Talladega race I've ever, ever commentated now. <laughs> this might be the strangest Talladega race I've ever commentated for this league, ever. <laughs> there's, yeah, there's a lot of strategy. Yeah, we got a lot of strategy, and we've had Ian and Killer Lee laps. <laughs> we... Yeah, we let, let's go through let's go through our lap leaders so far. So we've had um, we've had the six, which is normal, the seventeen, which is normal, the one, which is normal. We've had the eighteen, which is not normal, the four, which is not normal, and the three, which is not normal. Uh, what what's and we had the nineteen lead laps. So we, we we've had I don't know what this race is. I don't know what it is. It's a strategy race, but oh my god. This is like a big strategy race. This is like, you know, kind of, it's kind of weird. Well, see, the three pitted the exact same time they did. We're hearing that there might be still some fuel saving. That's what's going to Im implicate everyone, you know, trying to make it. But what, once these cars decide they want to push, this three is a sitting duck right now. This three car is a sitting duck. Because one huge run, the four is going to go right to the outside. Twelve shuffling on a line. Oh, here we go. Oh, well, uh, well, the four is going to get shuffled out of line. The 24 is going to make a run to the top. Here comes the 24, but here comes the eight of Hunter Boy. Hunter Boy is going to help the three. 24 making some contact with the three. And the 24 is going to go to the lead. Uh, and the 24 goes to the lead. Oh. <laughs> well, now the 24 is heartbroken. Okay, but here we go. Um, this is where everything's going to get a little bit interesting now because... We're hearing, we're hearing the 24 is good, so, and we're hearing it's six laps he has on, so it's either six or five to go, so. So, we're hearing it's going to be five to go at the line, so, this is where everything's going to start getting a little interesting right here. This is where a lot of people are going to start mixing it up if they're good on fuel. Couple cars might pit and take gas only, like the 18 and the one. So, but you know, we got to shout out. We got to shout out the three though for leading some laps though. You know, we we got to shout out the people that are not normally leading laps. They led some laps today. Uh, Killer, both RTSB brothers, basically, the 18, you know, and the four. So we got to shout them out. Two, two with a huge run. Two's got a huge run back there. It's basically a three-car pack right now up at the front. Basically a three-car pack unless this other pack can get a huge run right here. Here we go. We're going to be coming to about four to go. Oh, here we go. 88 with a huge run. A lot of people going outside. The four got basically left to dry. Oh, 88 blocking the 2 and the 17 in the wall. We got a crash. 17 around. 19's involved. No caution. The, the 88 threw a not a clean block and it kind of checked up the whole pack. Yeah, they, they didn't look like you left the lane open there in the corner. <laughs> but yeah, 17 got in the wall. I don't know. Oh, 21 to 18 are going to be pinned here, so... 17 and the 19. So, let's see. Here we go. I think it, we're coming to three to go. 
Three to go. So eight's going to drop. Remember, if you, if you need to pit, this is your last lap to pit because if you pit again, you're going to get basically handed a speed, uh, penalty for it. So, oh, the three, yes. Yeah, three. Yeah, the three. Oh, but here comes the two. Two's going to split it three wide. Oh, yeah, this is not going to be good. Yeah, not good. Not good. Well, this is uh, this is where uh, now the race is going to get interesting. Here we go, two to go. Remember, this is yeah, nobody's going to pit here. Nobody's pitting, so two two to go. Yeah, so they're yeah, they're they're going to have a massive run. They're going to have a massive run. That's going to be a five car run. Okay, oh, okay, 24 is giving out some orders here. Here we go. We're going to be coming the one to go. Stage two. Here we go. Two. The one's going to go with them. The two. Oh, a little block. They're blocking up here like it's no tomorrow. Here we go. Four is going to get back in line. Yeah, it's the 21 to 18. They've got two lap cars. One to go. Will they catch them? Yeah, one to go. Uh, the three's trying to make some on the outside. Oh, the 12. Yeah, the 12 and the 24 are trying to check up. So, you know, the 14, the 6, and the 2 can't get a run. Oh, yeah. Okay, so 24 says he's purposely brake checking here to start an accordion. 20, oh, 14 goes to the outside. They got a huge run, actually. They're going to get the second. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Run off of turn number four. And the 24 is going to win stage two. Here at Talladega, he's won stage one. He's won stage two. Okay. Good. <laughs> I think I just got censored. <laughs> well, final stage. Let's see. Will there, there will there be more fuel saving, or will we actually race? <laughs> That's going to be the question. So, yeah, the nine, yeah, the nine is going to be a huge non-benefactor. Oh, here we go. 24 and 12. Here we go as the force collarbones locking up. Green flag. Yeah, so here we go. So we're actually hearing it's going to be an actual racing stage. Unless... 12, 24, 30... 12, 24, 36. That's four laps a run. I think a four lap save or run would be the save strategy, which I don't know if anybody's actually going to do. Oh, here we go. Oh, 88 going to drop to the back. Oh, oh, there, there could be, there, there could be a huge run right here. I mean, here we go. 14. Yeah. All the Fords going to go to the, everyone's going to the outside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah here we go here comes yo th this is probably the rarest scene in racing right here you got two brothers working together <laughs> well I, in this league the last time I checked Caleb Kyle Bush and Kurt Bush don't race a little on the high side racing league <laughs>
Caleb, Caleb I, I, I know your collarbone's broken, but your brain's not, so this, we got a big problem. Well, that, that's going to lose a lot of ground. I don't know what just happened. I, I don't know if there was a checkup, somebody got loose. I don't know, but right now there's only three cars put together. The four is on the apron. The 18's going back and forth. I mean, I don't know what's going on. Here we go, 24. 24 is going to have a huge run here off of turn two. Huge run. Huge run. He's going to take it on board. Oh, the 19 with a sweet move. Dude, that is, that was a, a good move by the 19. Fake high and immediately get back down the lane. Make the 24 think you're going to go high and block that run. Come back down. Good job by the 19. I like that. I like that move. You know, you want to stay P5. You want to stay up in this pack. Track position is going to be a huge, huge factor. A big checkup. Oh, the oh the one in the 17 gonna get shuffled out of line. Oh, the, the three. Look at the three right now. One of the rare scenes in uh, high side. Two brothers working together. Oh, 19 gets shuffled out of line. Oh no, no, never mind. He's gonna get back in line. 24 couldn't couldn't. Uh, take advantage the 19 uh, the last time I checked this, this is a pace lap with the 19's going back and forth warming up his tires <laughs> here comes the 4 4 is going to look outside going to go back to the rear bumper of the 19 oh the 4 is going to move the 19 out of line and the 3 oh the 3 oh Okay, well, that you know that didn't work. Yeah, just get back behind the four. Oh, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Okay, so yeah, 14, two, top two. You got the six and third. You got the four and fourth. You got basically four, four cars, four Fords in top four right now. And all of them are even numbers, by the way. <laughs> One, uh, oh, here comes the three. Three's going to get shuffled out of line. Oh, here we go. This is where everything's going to start getting interesting now. 14, you got the two, you got the six. You basically got three about, yeah, you got about basically three cars that are working together. This is, this is, uh, this is when you start thinking about, you know, what would that that last lap? Oh, we got car hard in the wall. I just heard it. No, we don't. Okay, I just heard the biggest hit in my life. I heard the biggest smash of my life, and um, it was somebody's rear bumper, I guess. So, so, well, here we go. Single file line. We got Thomas the tank engine going around. If I don't see a move in the next three laps, I'm pulling out my phone. I'm playing Thomas the Tank Engine music. Let's go to the 14. I'm going to get YouTube ready. Got three laps. Okay. Here we go. Oh, okay. 24 in the four swap spots. I guess they're trying to make a make it better for themselves and late in the race. I guess you know. This is where everything's gonna start getting more interesting now. Is gonna be when that 24, because I know that 24 is gonna be making some moves. The biggest question: Will anybody else make some moves? That's gonna be the real big question. Huge run, kind of stalled. Uh, Thomas the tank engine. Let's see, one more lap. Better be a move made. Better be a move made here. Oh, 
You will go through the trial. Well, yeah, you got 14, you got the 2, you got the 6, you got the 24, and then you got the 4. That's currently your top uh, top 5. Here we go. One more lap. Will somebody finally make a move? Right now, this is a small pack. There's basically two packs right now. So, y'all, they're, they're going to need to figure out what to do right here. Because it is definitely going to be interesting, so. As they're discussing fuel before before pit cycle. Right now, you see the 14, you got the 2, you got the 6. It's, here we go. Thomas, the tank engine has arrived, folks. You got the 14, 2, 6. It's a single file line, and... Here we go. So we got pit stop starting. There you go, your Thomas the Tank Engine for a lap. So, you know, we're hearing pit cycles starting up soon. You know, right now the 14, the 2, and the 6. And now single file. So right now, there's two packs right now. Let's go to that four car pack back there. It's about four cars. You got the one, you got the 88, you got the 18, you got the 19. The problem is these guys are kind of, um, you know, these guys are kind of shuffling, which is not helping this rear pack right now. But, you know, as we got one car away in the back pitting, and that is the, well, that's the three killer he's pitting. Can this four-car pack get a legendary pit entry? That's the only way I see them catching up to a couple cars up here, is if they get a legendary pit entry. Here we go. Cars pitting. Yeah, a couple cars pitting. Those uh, three Fords up there. Who's going to come down? Oh, so yeah, 24 is come, uh, not going to come down here. 2, 14, and 6 going to come in. Oh, a couple other cars are going to be coming in as well, looks like. 3 is exiting pit road. 2, 14, and 6 are in. So those three are going to see if they can get their pit stops in and get out with each other. So now it's this four-car pack. Yo, know, we're going to see what that four-car pack can do. Here we go, 24, 4, 17. Yeah, everyone's. Here we go. Eight's going to get a huge push. There's five cars. Well, this is going to be interesting. This is about to be congested traffic here entering pit road. Oh, 17 hits the 24. I'm surprised nobody wrecked. <laughs> I'm surprised no one wrecked. <laughs> that just got interesting. Biggest question is the cars behind them. Did they get a good pit entry? Looks like the one's in, 19's in. Yeah, that, yeah, so we're hearing 20 to go. Is it 20 to go? It's going to be 19. You get 12 laps on fuel. That's a six lap, no, eight lap save. That's an eight lap save. Yeah, as wow, look at the four. Look at the 18. Actually, that there's going to be a five car pack. There's actually going to be a five car pack here. 
I'm just going to say this now. There's going to be a five car pack. That 12 is going to have to fall to the pack behind them. This actually could be an eight car pack and catch up to the front pack. Oh, 18, 19 making contact. Right now. Oh, no, no, it's going to develop into a four car versus a three car pack. Unless this pack can catch up to that eight and then catch up to the two, six, and the 12. This this pack right here could generate a huge run to get to the um, to get to that front three right there. Now this three car pack could definitely get up to that three car pack, but you know this four car pack that could turn into five cars could try and run down that three car pack, get up to that three car pack, which is now a four car pack. That's what the pack did not want to see. That's what the one, the 18, the 88, and the 19 did not want to see. So yeah, four car pack. So yeah, so there's four cars. Yeah, so yeah, you got the four car pack behind them. Huge run. Huge run. This is actually going to help that four car pack. That's going to help that four car pack out because now they're side by side battling up here. That four car pack can run them down and run some good laps. The thing is, they can stay consistently side by side here. That four car pack behind could catch up. Oh, the 17's going outside, so it's going to be a four-car pack on the outside. It's going to be a four-car pack on the outside. Oh, got some good pushes here. Oh, here we go. So we're hearing so we got some good pushing going on on this outside lane. This is what that four-car pack wants to see. And they're making ground. That four car pack behind them have been making ground. I'm just saying this. The the guys, this front seven, who are battling, they're about to get four more cars in this group. They're about to get four more cars in this whole group. Because if they keep battling like this, there's going to be four cars added to this group. So you got seven, you got four, that's going to be 11 cars. Oh, oh, they're going to let off. I think, I think the bottom lanes is going to let the top lane have it. Oh, that's not what the four car pack wanted to see. That's not what those four cars wanted to see because now they're outnumbered. Yeah. Now those cars are outnumbered. Question is pit, the pit stop strategy. I think four tires are out the window. I think, I think four tires are out the window. Two to two to no tires, I think, is going to be the strategy here. I'm thinking two to no tires are going to be the strategy right here. And that's where everything can get a little bit interesting right now. I definitely think I, I think two, two to no tires will be the strategy for a lot of these guys, like the six and the two and the eight. I definitely think that's it. Now, that four-car group, I'm going to have to say, you're going to have to make a bonsai move entering pit road. You're going to have to break late really late and see if you can just slow down your speed enough but you have to get up to that main pack you gotta hope somebody you know makes a mistake to where you can get up there now there's a lot of checking up there's a lot of guys backing off you can catch you can catch to that 12 you need some good pushes if you're the 1888 i'm giving the one car some good pushes right here i need pushing going on throughout this whole pack of this four cars to get up to that front pack right now if i'm these four you have to get some good pushes yeah these four cars are catching this pack better watch out because these four cars these four cars are about to get a huge run if they get that sniff of the draft from the 12, there's going to be a huge run coming right here. This is going to be huge for that, those cars. 14-3 have lost the pack. You know, that's sad for them. But right now, it, it's, definitely going to get, it's definitely going to get interesting now. A lot of checking up from the 19. If I'm 8, 88, I'm urging that 19 just to push me to get so we can get up there. I'm urging him just to push me a little bit more. They're almost there. Oh, I think there might be some sniffs of the draft right here for the one. There might be a couple sniffs. If I'm the one right here. Oh, 19 looked low on the 88. 
Huge run. One's going to have a huge run here out of four. Or the middle of three and four. They've caught him. They've caught him. That's just... That's all. All of them just caught up. Huge run. One's going outside. 18's going to stick with the 12. Thing is, yeah, this is, yeah, the one's going to get shuffled to the back now. So we're hearing it's 12. Technically, the pit window's open. Pit window is open. Pit window is technically open with 12 to go. Do you come down now? Do you think you can get enough of a group to pit now and come down? Oh, this is this is a big check. Oh, the four might have lost the pack. The four might have possibly lost the pack right here. He's in. He's in. He's in. He was in danger. He was in danger of losing that pack. Oh, here we go. A lot of strategy. There's the six, there's the two, there's the eight, top three. Now this pack's getting a little bit more interesting because now you got, you got now almost the whole field except for two cars in this group. Or it looks like the 19 might be pinned. No, that was, you went below. I'm just saying, a caution, a caution could he would be devastating for some guys right here yeah you know miss Q on pit road could be a, the whole benefactor of someone else she is we're looking from the one who's basically at the rear of this pack yeah 19 10 to go yeah 10 to go okay Yeah, that four, that four is getting a little risky losing the pack. Almost losing the pack, at least. They got a lot of help, but I mean, if I'm the one, if I'm the 19, if I'm the 18, I'm like, what are you doing right now? This is where everything starts getting a little interesting. 18, looking outside. Yeah, 18's had enough. 18's either dropping here or he's going to try and pass it. He's dropping. Yeah, I'm going to have enough if I'm the 19, if I'm the one or I'm the 18. We're about to lose the pack back here because they're checking up. Yeah. Oh, the 80, yeah, the 88's had enough too. He's like, I'm pushing the 12 out. You, you guys can keep checking up. I ain't going to appreciate it. Here we go. Oh, they're going to have a big pack. They're going to have a big pack because the one, oh, the one just passed the 19 below the yellow, but he was signaling though. Oh, there, there's going to be a lot more guys on pit road here for this first group. Last time it was about four, four cars coming in. This time, this might be five or six. Here we go. Cars in. Final stop. I, I'm going to suggest two tires. I think two tires has to be the call right here. You got at least five cars at least in that pack, so... Here we go, they're in. I say two tires could be your key right here. Okay. This is a little this is a little long for a pit stop for everyone. 19, 17, oh, 17 got a black flag. So it's only going to be three cars in this pack with the two, the six, and the 19. Yeah, it looked like the 17, the eight spent on pit road. That, that, that was a bad opportunity right there. That was bad. Now the biggest question is what do you do here if you're the 18 or the one? Yeah, everyone in this pack is pitting now. Oh, here we go. 18 and 1. They're probably going to come down right here.
Here we go. 88's coming down. 18's coming down. One's coming down. That's three cars. Although they're going to come down. Well, it'd be two tires for them. So, yeah, the 6, 2, and 19, they're, those three cars are immediately together. That's what you need when you come out of pit road. You need to immediately get into a pack. Here we go. 88, 18, and 1 are in. Here we go. 24, 4, and 12. These are the last three on the racetrack that haven't pit. Let's see what they do right here. Here we go. 4, 24, 12. All coming in. Oh, the 12 is getting a little loose, but he's going to save it. I'm actually going to be concerned. This is actually a terrible situation. This is, this is a terrible situation. The 24 has a huge gap between him, the 12, and the 4. That 24 might have to lose ground to get this pack. They're going to be coming the 5. That's what we're hearing. They're going to be coming the 5. Let's see, where's that other pack that came down? There they go. They're exiting now. The 18's all by himself. 88's all by himself. Oh, yeah, this is a terrible situation. But the thing is, the next packs. Let's see, where's that next pack? They have the six. Yeah, the six and the two and the 19 are way off the pack. 88 and the one are two cars, but it could be a three car pack. Oh, here we go. 24. Four is going to have a huge run here. Coming to, I think they're coming to four to go right here. Yeah, four is going to... Four didn't take the run. I'm not... I'm, the thing... I don't know why he didn't take the run. He, I think the four just ruined his opportunity for the lead right there. Uh, no wonder why he hasn't won an oval race. He just ruined. It, it, he had the perfect big run with the 24. They had only two cars. The next pack has two cars. The four. The four had. Yeah, the four had the biggest run that you could ever ask for with the 24 by himself. He did not take it. If the four doesn't win this race, oh, I don't know what to say. Yeah. I mean, these three got it. These three got it. So, here we go. Three to go. Three to go. Could the four finish second once again two seasons in a row here in this Talladega race? Or will, or will somebody dethrone that 24 who has won both stages today? It was. I was hearing it too. Here we go. Come the two to go. Oh yeah, the one in the 88 are disconnected. The one in the 88 got a little disconnected right there. Yeah, I mean, it, you know, these three can battle out right now. I mean. Oh, here we go. Oh, we got, one. and the caution is out. There's a wreck on the back. As well, I think, uh, let's see, the 17, 14, looks like the three, the eight, was weirdly on the bottom of the racetrack. What even happened? We're hearing Hunter Boy got in with the uh, 17. 
Uh, I think that, I think, I think this is going to get interesting. Here we go. Overtime. Here from Talladega. Green flag. Oh, the four, all the 12 got to the inside of the four. All but the four kind of just, oh wow, the 12 of them have it. If I was the 12, I would have just, you know. Well, here we go. Two lap shootout. People are going to be trying to get to that outside, so it's all it's everybody's game now. Down the back straightaway. Yeah, everybody's already single file, so this is where the runs are going to have to be managed right here. You'll probably see a lot of people start backing off now. It will be that first car to back off, try and get the run into turn one. Or the run out of two. Here we go. Come into the white flag. One more lap remaining from Talladega. Oh, they're almost wrecking back there. 14 and somebody else got into it. Yeah, the four. The run's going to have to come from like second or third here. And I, the four is not backing off. The 12 is not backing off. They, they, might, they might let this 24 have it. Yeah. Yeah, no moves being made yet. A lot of backing off. Three and four. And there, there's going to be no move. I, I don't think. Oh, six made a move. I don't think it's going to be enough, though. Second place did not make the move. Yep, and the 24 is going to win. And yeah, 24 is going to win. And another very lackluster finish here at Talladega. Yeah, it, it looked like the 4 just, the four and the 12 just had the 24 right there. Almost looked like the B-Series all over again. <laughs> Wow. Well, that was, that was a little lackluster. Who got the top three? Okay. Okay, so we're doing second and third place. Um. Well. I cannot wait to interview second place because I, I got really, really interesting. Well, here we go. Let's go ahead and go to your second place finisher today, Mr. Marcel. Who finishes second in the Talladega playoff race once again. Um, Caleb, you got a copy there, buddy? Yeah, I gotcha. Audience included. Well, um, explain yourself. There was no run even attempted to be made in even the last five laps in overtime. What happened there at the end of the race? Because it looked like there was nothing even attempted. In my opinion, in my opinion, it was like we're three at the t at the top, top three out to the pits. Let's get the draft going and just try to get some speed going. That way, if anybody's in the back trying to catch up to us, we're not. They're not catching up to us. Um, I'm not in the playoffs, so I mean, a win's a win, yes. But I'm just out there having fun. Um, I mean that restart definitely could have done that a little bit better um but it is what it is i kind of started to drop back a little bit into three to see if i couldn't get a run on off of four but by the time i could get the run to possibly try to go around the 24 there for the win the six was on my outside and it was going to be a wreck fest if i even tried so i just said screw it i'm going to push colin to the lead and get the win there Okay, well, second place once again. Just tell us how you feel about second place here at this Talladega race. Cause you got it last season losing to Ding. Now you got it losing to the 24 this season. Yeah, I mean, I could have planned last season a little bit better. But, I mean, this season I'm not disappointed about it. I've gotten used to not winning. So, plus it's a super speedway, so it's not like a real oval. So I probably wouldn't have gotten any accolades for it. So... It is what it is. Um, I'm glad. I'm glad we got a one, two, three there, though. So everything worked out pretty well. So I'll take it. Top three is not bad for me. 
Okay, well, anything you want to share? Shout out here before you interview your winner. Uh, shout out to you, Air, for uh, doing these uh, streams for us, and uh, good luck on the road to 600. Okay, uh, congratulations on your P2, and we wish you good luck uh, for Kentucky on uh, Tuesday, or not Thursday, Thursday. Woo! Let's go. Okay, let's go to the 24, who swept everything today and won the race. Um, high side, Hobie. High side, you got copy there, buddy. Yeah, I got copy. Well, another win in the books. Um, what was your reaction to the four never making a move there in those final five laps? Well, that was the initial plan because I mean, my my thought was I didn't know that the six, the two, and whatever car was with them black flagged. I just thought that we were moving fast enough to where we just got a better pit exit when we were passing them on the track. I didn't realize they black flagged. So in my head, we had the 88, the 1, the 2, the 6, and whatever other car there pushing each other. So I drug the brake just a little bit to let the 4 and the 12 get back to me. That way, if it was a 5-car pack, we could go. So what Caleb was saying was we linked up with three cars to get as much draft as possible to try to get as organized as quickly as possible to get our speed to where it needed to be to try to outrun those guys. Because if it was five, I didn't find out until two laps later that it was only the 88 and the one. Um, we would have been in a better position to, to win the race. Um, the plan was is to push each other and then either with two or one laps to go, kind of mix it up. That way, if there's a caution, it's not going to screw and mess up everybody else. It's just going to kind of affect the three guys that are up there. So I wasn't surprised at all because that was, that was the plan. Work together like we have been all race and, See what happens at the end. Well, another win on the season. Uh, right now, one of the favorites to win the championship and go for a back-to-back -back, uh, seasons winning the championship. Um, tell us, you know, how you, how's your feeling this season? I know when you win the last season, you weren't really confident due to the fact that, you know, the jinx was still around, that you couldn't win a title. You couldn't, you know, you couldn't perform well in these championship races at the end of those. But then uh, when you won the championship, you know, you feel pretty confident now with the monkey off your back from last season that you can go in to try and get your second title pretty confident now? I think it's going to be determined on whoever is in the Final Four. If I have people that I know that I can run with and outpace, confidence is sky high. If I have people that I know that I maybe can't beat at that certain track, then it's going to be a little bit shaky. But, uh, you know, it's going to be fun no matter who's in it. Um, I just got to make sure that myself gets into it because I don't, I mean, it's not guaranteed yet. It was a good night in points, but there's still four races left before the Final Four race. Got to make sure that I, one, stay in the races, two, finish good in the races, and three, actually show up for the races. So still a lot of racing left to be deeming me in the top four. I've seen a lot of stranger things happen. Two or three seasons ago, I was in the top four, and then I lagged out of Chicagoland and then wasn't able to make Richmond, and I went from the top all the way to fifth and didn't make the final four. So all it takes is two races, and I'm in, I'm in deep crap. Okay, well, anything you want to say a shout-out here before we end the stream tonight? Yeah, shout-out to the four and the 12. They are the real reasons that I won that race tonight. Without the teamwork, I wasn't winning that race. So that was that was their win just as much as it was my win. I know that they didn't finish on the on top, but they get that win marked off in their column just as much as me because we were linked up whether I was in the back or I was in the front the entirety of the night. So that was a team win, not just a 24 win. Okay. Well, congratulations on your win, and we wish you uh, good luck for Kentucky on Thursday. Thank you. Well, well we're going to end the stream tonight. Um, very lackluster finish there to the end of the Talladega race. Strategy was interesting in the first couple stages. And that ending is, oh my god. Uh, well, thank you guys for tuning in and watching. And we'll see you guys for Kentucky uh, on Thursday. I'm Air Just Cause. We'll see you guys next time.